Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the third week of July for the Capricorn Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful positive energy vibration that um, you Capricorn have given to me. Um, and um, I want to say please like, share these videos. Go and check out the love readings, you Capricorn. Um, there is... Um, Especially because these young love readings are first we, I did the general, then the two of um, the the singles, and then the people in relationship. Go check that out. The people in relationship is at the back of the video. Okay. Now, um, this is the third week of July, and uh, the week begins from the 15th until the 21st. So we're calling up in the angels and guides. For the Capricorn Sun Moon Horizon sign to show us what is the message, what is going to affect the Capricorns in uh, this third week of July. Now, we've seen we're seeing the Eye Princess. The Eye Princess is here. Whenever the energy of the Eye Princess comes up, is that listen to your intuition. Whatever is transpiring around you, listen to your intuition in this week, you Capricorns. Um, listen to your own intuition over another person's intuition. Then we have the energy of uh, the ten of um, ones in the reverse. Oh, nine of ones. Listen to your intuition because your spirit guides are protecting you. Um, whatever the issues is for you, Capricorns, listen to your intuition. Okay. What else is coming up for the Capricorn Sun, Moon, and Rising sign? Uh, um, speak up, speak up. You're going. If you speak up, you're going to be cutting through the BS. Okay, speak up with a situation and cut through the BS because some people wants to hold you in a, a negative um, situation. Then we have the Four of Cups, so no reverse, um, no regrets over a situation because you spoke up for yourself you have absolutely no regrets over a situation because what you did was to speak up for yourself to an injustice then we have the energy of the ten of cups happiness and joy with the family there is um, a balance that is going to be coming in um, with the, with the family because you spoke up over an injustice situation that has taken place the ace of swords is communication cutting through the bs the energy of uh, um, um negative people are here and that could come up on saturday so be aware of that be aware of where you go on saturday and we have the energy of the five of swords so definitely you're having some conflicts in this week you Taurus, you capricorns with um the energy of these negative um, people these deceptive negative people what is going to be the central energy for the Capricorns in this week central energies we're dealing with the king of cups so speak up there is an issue with the king of cups you need to speak up this could be an ex boss this could be a new boss or ex boss that is coming in you need to speak up and communicate very clearly about certain energies and certain situation now we have the negative of energies of people around you it could be um some of you have no regrets about the situation with the king of cups whatever the issue is this could have been an ex boss some of you um stand up against this person this could have been someone you're working on the floor but whoever you are there is an energy of you dealing with a pisces cancer or a scorpion person now the eye princess is here what is the message for the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn in this week of the third week because uh, I'm seeing you guys like oh, I really don't care I'm just saying I'm just saying um, what I feel so the eye princess is here and when the eye princess is here some of you could be connecting with a psychic uh-huh oh yeah Oh, 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 you some of you could be dealing with a psychic or some of you could be um, receiving your own psychic messages because the eye princess is here and she's saying it's uh, uh, good news is on the, the way. 
um, and it could be an issue with a child in the past, but this is coming up as new love. Um, it could be your intuition is right about a child. Some of you, you're going to be finding out that your intuition was right about a child. But some good news is coming in, and this is definitely going to be resolved, okay? This is definitely going to be resolved. Number 10 energy is the energy for you guys. So something is ending, a new start is happening. Um, the Omega the universe, the I princess, your guides and angels are talking to you and, and bringing you messages because whatever the issue was that you were having with a child, um, whatever the issue was that you were having with a child, now there is going to become in balance. For some of you, a new love could be coming in and you could be receiving message from this person. This new love in some way is going to be releasing your burdens, okay? So um, always for, uh, this is a general reading, so um, this is definitely a general reading. So you have to check out um, if you are seeing someone new in your life, some real positive news. Some of you, um, you could be finding out that you're pregnant. Um, <laughs> so that is good. So if you went on vacation and you went um, enjoying, you could be finding out that you're pregnant and your burdens is going to be over. The Ten of Wands, you, some of you have some burdens and it, it's affecting um, the young people and it's a karmatic issue and there is a judgment call that is going to be coming up so whoever you are um, whoever you are some of you are affected by um, carrying bur your home burdens or the burdens of other people and it's as if burdens and obstacles is coming up for some of you but it is for the younger people the people between the ages of 18 and 45 there are burdens and these burdens that is coming up is affecting you young people between the ages of 18 and 45 it's as if you're carrying so much burdens there's so much things that you're dealing with and um, these issues are coming from past life whatever is transpiring these issues are coming from past life and you're going to be receiving some information some of you could be receiving some um, or you could be um, this is um, receiving information giving out information unexpected information coming in about a Pisces cancer or a scorpion okay so this could be a family member for some of you some of you this could be information about your father that is coming in so whatever the effect if and whatever the situation is this burden and this burdensome situation whatever is transpiring is coming from a past life issue that you have been dealing with for quite some time okay so um that's definitely what is happening i'm sorry so um we are definitely definitely um having some issues um that we have to deal with and um whatever the issue is uh, um whatever the issue is um this situation is coming up and you need to understand what is transpiring and knowing that uh, these are karmatic issues there's a lot of burden that you young people are carrying okay so the ace of swords is here for the capricorn and it's the central the crowning of the week let's see what is happening for you guys okay so um, you're communicating um, with a, a project you could be working on a project there is deceptive people um, there's jealousy deceptive people and you're having um, some regrets so some of you but your wishes and dreams are going to be coming true but your wishes and dreams is going to be coming true so um, I'm seeing a lot of you you could be communicating your work that you do could be communicating but um, you're speaking up and you're speaking out against uh, some negative actions of other people and you are just moving forward because it's an issue 
with some of you you have your own project you were working on your own project and what is transpiring is that the energy of deceptive people and you're cutting the BS out okay you're definitely cutting the BS out and your wishes and dreams is going to be coming true because people have seen your work that you have done people have copied your work that you have done and try to make it their own a lot of people um, copy other people things they can see other people doing things and think that they can do it better and copy other people things because I'm seeing this and you're standing up and you're saying hell no you're not going to copy everything that I do and you're gonna be changing up something about your project because it's as if people have gain a lot of money off your project because a lot of people have copied your project gain a lot of money and you're like hell no no this was my idea I'm I take I'm bringing out my idea because this was my idea this has always been my idea so whatever the, it is but your wishes and dreams is going to come true because what is here and what is transpiring and let me ask what is this energy with the ace of swords seven of pentacles and the seven of pentacles has to do with your project networking and there is a lot of jealous jealous people because the energy of the devil is here in the four of cups and you're like everyone is just copying you're going to be successful do not do not even think about um these people ladies 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 so all you ladies who are in this energy came up all you ladies that has been getting a fight a negative fight against a project your business something that you have been doing and you're gonna be very successful and here it is again that's what came out when these energies came out is that they're telling you don't give up despite what this energy is saying these people who carry this energy is just that they didn't come up with that idea so whatever um, slash backs that you're getting don't worry because success you'll be successful over these people who are just being very um, you know they there are some people who can't be happy for you okay so you ladies whatever project whatever network whatever you're doing and there are people who are you know trying to speak bad and the, and the rest know that your 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 wishes and dreams are going to be coming true and it's going to be affecting a lot of ladies who have been trying to help others okay it's as if people are jealous of what you came up with and um you know the universe the universe and this is it and this is what a lot of people do not understand you can see someone else doing something and you copy them that doesn't say that that is your divine life part and because some people just know what it is they were meant to be and this is really a form of jealousy that is coming at you ladies because I'm seeing that you ladies are doing something that is really helping humanity and helping others and there are other people who are being jealous and there's a lot and you're like cutting out the BS and you know it's as if whatever you know people whatever you know you're trying to do something to help humanity and there are other people that is trying to fight you down and you know you're just cutting away the BS and you're moving forward because you have absolutely no regrets okay four of cups in reverse you're finding inner strength and balance to deal with a situation where there's no regrets four of cups energy what is coming up and it's going to affect the ladies um, 45 years and older you're going to be ending a conflict okay latest 45 years and older whatever the issue was you're ending this okay so you could have had a situation with a Virgo or you could have had a situation with a Sagittarian you're bringing this down okay you're bringing it down and you're really not having any regrets so, um, against what has happened and what has transpired you're very much bringing this down so this is good so latest four five years and older you're coming up in your reading now we have um, the ten of cups which is the bloodline family issues so let's see what is coming up for what is it that is coming up for the um, Capricorn Sun Moon Horizon sign 
okay so a wonderful messages is going to be coming in um, messages is going to be coming in and um, you're going to be receiving a new start uh, and uh, I'm sorry guys but it's my cousin she's like so worried about me um, and um, and um, what is transpiring because she's gonna keep on texting and calling um, so I was right here ten of cups so family there is going to be a really wonderful family connection that is coming in a lot of messages is going to be coming from families a lot of communication back and front communication new start is going to be coming up between you and other family members new start or definitely the truth is going to be coming out and um, I love this energy because this is always shedding light on something okay so whatever has transpired between you and family members this is going to be resolved because here it is that um, news is coming from families and a new start is coming up and it's as if you're going to be offered something and whatever you're offered because here is news coming in um, from a family member that is coming up to offer you something whatever they're offering take it because it's going to bring a really positive stability in your life it could be um, a, a, um, someone who is coming up as a very good friend so a very good friend or a family member but um, this is the ten of clubs so it's always bloodline but sometimes we feel even closer than our own bloodlines with a good friend or so because I, I have that with my girlfriend I feel as if she's like my little sister and, um, and she could be watching yes you know I love you and um, I feel as if she's more of a family to me which I don't have sisters and brothers um, something comes out so um, some of you are not going to be receiving message from the, the king of cups um, that could be an issue but um, let's see what is coming up first with the energy and um, whatever the issue is I'm seeing that some of you are waiting on a message from the king of cups but is either the message is delay or there's going to be some interruptions between you and that person the energy of the devil is here for the Capricorns in the third week. What is this all about? It's about deception, lies, and deception. And it has to do with the King of Wands. So whoever this King of Wands is, this is a really nasty, deceptive person. And he's coming up as, um, he's coming up. This King of Wands is an Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius. This is a vindictive, hateful person. Some of you ladies out there, and I think this is where the Capricorn, some of you Capricorn ladies out there, or maybe other people, could have been dealing with the King of One. The King of One is an Aries. Check him out. If you're dealing with a fire sign person, an old person, this person at Create is real, is an Aries, the devil. This Aries man has created and really deceivingly stole something and um, stole something but the seven of cups coming up he tried to steal your future or something that was offered to you they're going to be finding him he's going to jail he's not going to miss it he's definitely going to jail this man is a really nasty piece of work he's an Aries man 45 years no this man is like going to the 70s lies and deception the man he can he can write a story with his word with his mouth he can sell you he can sell you the thorn on a roses that's bad selling someone the thorn on a roses this this Aries man is just totally ridiculous he's mentally unstable let's look at the five of swords you're going to be having some issue with this man okay 
and you're you have walked away from this man and this man keeps on coming back and coming back and coming back and there is going to be some heartbreaks because whoever this man is you you have turned your back on this person definitely because he has created a lot of issues in your life this man could have broke in your house this man is a lying deceptive man this man um, has done some in deceptive things he could be an ex-husband that you're trying to get rid of this man um, is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius for some of you but it's, he's coming up as an Aries the strength of an Aries so um, totally ridiculous the man is mentally disorder um, lies deception and here it is you turn your back and you're walking away from him and you're going to be victoriously celebrating getting rid of this man once and for all there was some heartbreaks but um, what is going to transpire this man has um, got in your family um, this man has got in your family and whatever this man has this man has lied this man is for some of you women 45 and years and older this man he has stolen from you he has broken in your house he has lied he's on your telephone he 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 he's going to jail God damn it go to jail you stupid ass oh 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 so some of you could have been dealing with this man either with uh, uh, he's he tries to affect your your living situation he has broken in your house this could be for some of you it's the last seven years or seven years ago or between seven years and now he has broken in your house and finally they found out what he has done finally they are finding out the truth the man has disrupted your life for the last seven years it this this issue happened in 2012 the man and now finally peace came and this is a really deceptive man he's he's I, he doesn't know his truth different from his lies and when someone don't know their truth different from their lies they're psychic on balance and over the finger there's nothing about bipolar with them they're just mentally sick and deranged okay and um, a lot of people have this because um, um, and it's dealing with this person because they're going to find out what he has done because here is a peace is finally coming um, to the home and uh, he has disrupted so many people lives if the man is mentally mentally unstable he has disrupted so many people lives and um, <laughs> it's my cousin oh my god um, um, he has disrupted um, so many people lives yeah. and uh, and now they found out that he has been um, such a big old liar and now um, they are resolving the issue because they realize what this man has done this man is seriously serious they shouldn't be walking out in normal public this man <laughs> this man can sell you this man can sell you milk and coffee and taking out the milk out of the coffee that's all ruthless this man is that means he's just selling you BS okay he can give you a story and when you check the story out it's just BS he's really having some problem with his guides <laughs> anyway let's move on um, the king of cups some of you are dealing the Capricorns are dealing with the king of cups what is this all about in this third week the king of cups and the queen okay you're gonna be really seeing the truth of a situation with the king of cups and an Aries Leo or Sagittarius now these Aries Leo and Sagittarius people are coming up in your life now they could be um, connected to you whether via marriage or extended but there is something that is going on 
with this king of cups this king of cups and this aquarius lady has been coming up for you capricorns for quite some time i've seen her and here it is that you're not going to be hearing anything else from them because these two people are going to be um, just as came down on them because they lied and they created um they lied and they created and this is another aries woman but it could be an um an aquarius gemini or um, a leo or a sagittarius or ophiosis but the devil energy is on top of them so they did these two people have uh, conjured up together and did something very deceptive and is changing someone information they lied and used someone else's information and give someone information and they're working with a ripple a, a huge corporation a huge worldwide corporation this is like a corporation that um sells um time space on radio and this lady god oh my god lady i am so amazed by you how deceptive you are and she and this man have done really they work together against some of you guys Oh my gosh because they have been coming up I've been seeing both of them in more readings go check out the weekly readings because these two have been coming up these two are people 45 years and older but this lady and I think it's jealousy um, this lady is very jealous against you this lady some of this lady is coming up um, for some of you like she is a stepmother but for some of you she's coming up like a lawyer but lie and deceiving oh my god lady you need some help oh god but um, they have found out they're caught and found out both of them I think this man is like a cancer for some of you this man is like a cancer and both of them has done some with this old Aries man oh my god um, these two could have um, either intercept um, somebody information is like they had an issue with a worker or something like that or an employee and they um, copied the key and went in their houses they got someone to um, access the people internet and place something on their computer these two people Oh my god they should not see the blessed day again they should be really pace these two people are really um, and you know ladies and gentlemen and I'm not really exaggerating I am just I think I was just so protected growing up and I think my you know the way I was brought up is that you respect other man's um, Ottoman's property these two people had no respect because they lie and this man has gone too far they have now been caught for what they were doing this lady and this man got someone to place something on somebody's info um, computer to pick up their information it's, it's really sad these two people they should not see in the light of day um, and, and I think this woman has something to do I think she's a lawyer for him or the notaries for him or she was um, an HR person oh god lady you're sick but anyway whoever it is oh you Capricorns um, oof, what a nasty set I, I don't know I don't know how people can do these horrible things and then they have kids I mean what do you tell your kids Oh, honey, you know what I did at work today? Um, there's there's this lady. She's innocent, but yet still, um, I have to win this case for my husband. So I placed something on her computer. So I'm I'm taking up her information and selling her information or something. You know how can you, as a person who was a child, can do these sort of a things? You're no um example. Um, to set a proper child and to set proper basics for children I don't know that's why I just think that some people should not have kids and you know when you're going to deceptively done something else against an innocent person and whoever they did it to you Capricorns and you are like 
I have no idea who these people are. You, you, you can't even connect to understand that these people would have done what they have done. Sick. But um, whoever was in, um, unjustly accused, um, they have to pay you a lot of money because they were found guilty and um, this is a situation where they could be going to jail also because of what they have done okay so wow cappies I love you guys it's a karmatic situation it's coming from past life and I think this lady is just a little bit twisted and off and it's um it's weird when people can't see that for themselves and you know there is um I've done I, I coach a lot of people and I respect the people who kind of feel as if um, you know they there is something wrong with me why I can't do certain things and I respect people like those because they go out and they ask for help and the other thing is that if you're just gonna feel Hunger towards another person who you really don't know and you're going to be judging another person who you really don't know That's not good because basically you're judging yourself and everything that you do to others that is destructive You're destructing you're really being destructive to your own self and if it doesn't affect you now it will affect your kids it will affect um, your family members because you're creating karmas and this is why um, so many things happens to other people and uh, this is a issue where you know you you really needed to know when to draw the line and some of you especially this lady and this man um, they kind of lost where to draw the line okay forgiveness is the key three of water success is coming up you um, people are really going to be successfully overcoming an issue um, twice success is here so thank God for you Capricorns a wonderful reading I am wishing all of you Capricorns a lot of love um, riches and abundance prosperity money a whole lot of money because trust me you you um, you Capricorns has gone through so much I'm wishing you happiness and bliss in your life namaste until next week